Hey guys, I actually went looking for what the Sunken Scroll was I was missing. You actually fall off that platform, go down there, and it's a little pipeway that comes up here. You hit all the boxes, come up here, and the Sunken Scroll's right there. So, I think we're not that far from being this uh, level. Oh, never mind. I thought that would take me right to the next area. So, there we go. And you know what? I've kind of played around the sniper a bit. I kind of don't hate it anymore. I'm never going to use it in like the competitive field by any stretch, but I don't hate it. <laughs> okay, found checkpoint. Also, when you complete a mission and you go back to it, you actually get a little plushie. It's a tiny little plushie! Okay, sorry about that guys, I just, I was, it was really irking me, like, I just didn't find it. I'm like, it's gotta be obvious. And, to, to agree to disagree, it kinda was obvious, but at the same time, not entirely. So, this time, we're going back to uh, level 5. Mostly because level 5 is the closest one to then level... God, was it? 4? No. Well, I kind of map. Um, 8, I believe. Yeah, level eight's where I think it is. Level 8 is right there. So next up, level 5. A Sheldon request. This can't be anything good. No, knowing Sheldon, he's gonna go like Use, you should use like the splat roller. I'm like, I don't want to use the splat, splat roller. I'm so bad at it. Oh, the the dualsies. Oh, yeah, this is actually something that was extremely hyped up for Splatoon 2. You could dodge a lot of SMB. Okay. Okay, so it controls like any other. Okay, that's kind of cool. So, like, oh, that's a dodge roll. Okay. Twice in a row. Interesting. Okay, this is kind of like more my play style. I kind of like uh, dual wielding stuff sometimes. Also, sorry, that, that came on my end. That scared me slightly. I think someone's trying to drill something. Probably just destruction near the house. Or near this house, honestly. I mean, can you guys hear that, or is that just me? I want to hit you. I got it. And I definitely know, I was talking to a friend of mine uh, before Splatoon 2 even came out, and I was playing Splatoon 1 with uh, my friend. Uh, yeah, we were both really hyped for um, the dual the dualsies. And now that I gotta play with them, you know what? Yeah, they're not that bad. But now I have to be extra uh, uh, cautious of where we're going because I need to find the sun scroll.
Also, with the music, I'm getting Rhythm Heaven uh, vibes. I don't know people who've played Rhythm Heaven. I'm pretty sure there's a very small amount of you guys. But doesn't this remind you of Rhythm Heaven? That wasn't really all that hard. We got a ticket. Nice. Is there anything worth a note over here? Probably not. Wait, what? How? I guess we'll find out later. I don't know what that is, but that's really loud. I'm sorry, I know what it is, I just don't know where it's coming from, I should rather I should say rather. Uh nothing really important. That scared me because I thought I was gonna die. Oh, there's the tuna. Er, sardine. So where is the thing now? the eggs. It's gotta be you. Aha! That's actually kinda clever. I appreciate that, game. Way to go. You made me smile. And not just because we're a squid and a kid. Hey. Surprise! <laughs> oh, that makes me feel too evil. Doolsies! Not gonna lie, the doolsies are really fun. I can actually probably see myself playing with the doolsies once in a while. You know what, just for the hell of it, let's keep the doolsies on. Check out the weapon log. Okay. Yeah, I got the ticket, and then we got the next thing. Wow. Uh, hold did we get there now? Like, I'm speculating, I'm speculating it's over there. Oh, maybe like that. Let's go. The shell request. Uh, we're not playing with the duels, the, the, the woolsies. We're not playing with the woolsies, guys. Oh. Eh, hero shot. Sure, sure, it's the vanilla. This sounds kind of uppity. Come 
Wow, that was horrendous. Oh, we got our ticket. I mean, yay? Question mark? Can't trick me. God, everything's just hidden. Get over there. Thank you. Uh, it's over there. Oh, it is the sardini. The sardini. Got one Italian. Like the most flamboyant Italian ever, apparently. Oh, that's kinda cool. Whee! Uh, sorry guys, that's, that's just a little too funny to me. Okay. The Octarian looks super suspicious. Be fine. Oh, that's cool, but how do I get to you without dying? That's right now. Okay. Okay. Right there, right there. Don't stop the rock now. <laughs> you got to get it owned. And I am the owner. Oh, hello, favorite thing from Splatoon 1. Nuke everything! Everything must be nuked! Going up. Gotcha. Five minutes even. Interesting. You were close. Interesting. We got a ticket. 
We got another boss fight and the ticket at the same time. Hello, very Japanese style arts. Huh. Did not realize how much that actually looked like Okami. And this is the showdown fearful, the fear, fear of the Octo Samurai. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> okay. More data on the roller. I mean, like, he seems to be having a roller himself. Is this going to be a samurai or a sumo fight, is my curiosity. Oh, this is kind of cool. Except you look so silly already. Are you on a tiny tricycle? He is on totally a tiny tricycle. I'm sorry, I'm too busy like laughing internally over this. This is kinda dumb. And now I'm getting Goemon's Great Adventure flashbacks, even though I've like never actually played that game. Oh that is not a pleasant thing to feel. Take it, take it, tag it! Instead of letting me just catch you being a little dirty boy, because you're gonna get slapped. Here it comes! Look at this derpy little face. That really derpy, like, trice, a uh, uh, unicycle. Hello, Cloud from King of Hearts. Holy cow. Oh, crap. Oh, karate, I could probably say. What? Okay, that was my bad. That was entirely my bad, actually. Oh, he doesn't stop after one go. Thought he would.
Okay. That boss fight is kind of on the interesting side. But I got it. I, I got it. I'm just really should pay attention more. Oh, he, his little soul is jumping in the, the tricycle. Oh. Unicycle, not tricycle. Let me you know this. You saved a zapfish. The three minutes, huh? Okay. Yeah, no. Roller, you're interesting. But that boss fight, I was done with. Okay, so I'm going to switch to the toolsies. Or the woozies, as I keep calling them. And let's jump to the next area. Okay guys, I actually think that this may be the last video we do in Octo Valley, just for a tiny bit. Mostly due to the fact that it's mostly, we're almost done for the most part. And I just don't want to like overlay this a Let's Play with a bunch of Octo Valley and nothing but Octo Valley stuff. So we're going to lay off Octo Valley for a bit. Does this mean we're done with Octo Valley? Of course not. We're going to be doing a lot more stuff in Octo Valley. But I think the next video I'm going to do is just going to be mostly for, um, uh, for, I can talk. It's going to be, uh, online stuff. So, next time we meet back up to play more Splatoon, I will have enough of an idea of what we're going to be doing. But, also at the same time, before we go, I want to, guys sh I want to show you guys something that I'm going to be doing a lot. Between now and the next video. I am going to be A, shopping. You know, the big thing of Splatoon and what makes people come back to Splatoon every so often. So, we have a Chloe shop, which I need, but don't necessarily want. Yes. <laughs> Why would I not? Yeah, that. Uh, I believe this is the uh, Ammo Knight, which Sheldon works at. I believe it's Sheldon, right? Nope, this is the shoe wear. Whoops, I made a mistake. So, as you guys can probably tell, we have a bunch of areas, our uh, clothing on us. We have two, we have shirts, we have shoes, we have shirts, and we have hats. I'm going to be buying a lot of things off, um, obviously, just all this, all the stuff working on. And, uh, I'm trying to actually find out where the, where the armor shop is, or the weapon shop. Uh... Are you the, you're, you're the hat shop, you're, uh, Jalonzo? Yeah, you're Jalonzo, I don't need you. I, I, I'm not in the mood to shop to you. I'm trying to find out where the freaking ammo knight is. Oh, here it is. It's right here. Guys, I'm smart. So obviously I'm going to be trying out different weapons, I'll be doing a lot of uh, off-screen stuff. But weapons are the one I want to talk about, actually. Weapons are as follows. You can try them out if you need to, you can level them up and do other things. And... I, Sheldon, Sheldon, buddy, you, you can stop, I don't need to learn all of this. I'll explain this later too. Yeah, I'm just gonna hit fast forward. <laughs> Does he explain every weapon to you? What the hell? Sheldon, it's cool! Okay, so as I said, uh, weapons are the very interesting thing. They actually become unlocked as you level up. 
I don't think any clothing or anything else unlocks as you level up. And as you can tell, there is a lot of weapons. I mean, I'm going to be here for quite some time. Also, if I want to, I can pass travel between shops. I like you. You're weird. So, I'll see you guys next time. After me going nuts and buying everything I can. Testing out weapons that I like, testing weapons I don't. I'll see you guys later.